It says much of what you see, uh, what you, much of what you say seems straightforward. I'm not sure I understand the need for a sheikh. The thing is that the nafs, the self, everyone's the hero of their own movie, and that you d don't usually change. You know, you can try for yourself, but what most people find is that when, as soon as they hear about the meritoriousness of reciting the Quran, off they are reciting the Quran for two weeks, and then they don't have the persistence to stay with it, and then they give up, and <laughs> you know, then, then they set to start something new, and they start to do that for a little bit, and then they give up, and they. A uh, sheikh is there to make sure that the things of the tariq happen the way that they're supposed to and happen continuously and the person is taking steps forward all the time and not taking steps backward. Or if he falls on his nose that he picks himself up and dusts himself off and go, continues to go forward. This is what the sheikh... The, the sheikh is not a condition in the tariq, but the sheikh is something to make sure that the conditions happen the way that they're supposed to. You know. And uh, there's no question that the Marifa, the knowledge of the divine, it's uh, something that can only be taken from someone who has it. And so this is what the Sheikhs mention about it. Allah knows best. <laughs>